They were the biggest sports success story in recent memory. Now the Hampton Roads Admirals are confidently preparing for an encore. But a year ago, they didn't know what to expect. We really had our fingers crossed. We honestly didn't anticipate the kind of uh, acceptance that we got. As I said kind of facetiously, we don't try to analyze it too closely. We don't want to screw it up. <laughs> Last winter, the Admirals were the hottest ticket in town. Scope was sold out five different times, and in their first year of play, the Admirals led the league in attendance. And if the preseason is any indication, they'll do it again. Season ticket sales have tripled to nearly 3,000. The size of the program has doubled. If you want to buy a billboard, forget it. They're sold out. And the Admirals even have their own line of souvenirs. Fans did it, and that's not, I don't just say that. Uh, when you draw that many people, we, we, did, we did become noticed. They know their hockey. They know what they like. They know good entertainment. The biggest key to the Admiral's success was their performance on the ice. Their entertaining brand of hockey earned them a playoff berth, and they plan on being even better this season. I can't get over how many people can't wait till this season starts. I think I got seven or eight players that got a chance to be excellent players in the league, and I think it'll make us a lot better hockey club. The East Coast Hockey League has added teams in Cincinnati, Louisville, and Richmond. Opening night's October 26th, and here's a little advice. Get your tickets soon. John Castleberry, Wavy News 10 Sports.